Ang susunod na programa ay Rated G. Ito ay pwede sa lahat ng manonood. Good day everyone. This is Grace of Kipilas. And this is Carol Body odor are common when you're exercised or you're too warm. They are also common when you're feeling nervous, anxious, or stressed. Sweating and body odor are caused by sweat glands in your body. The, the two main types of sweat glands are equine glands and apocrine glands. Equine glands occur over most of your body and often directly onto the surface of the skin. When your body temperature rises, these glands release oils that out of your body as they evaporate. Secondly, opposite glands are found in areas where you have hair such as your armpits or your eyes. These glands release a melting fluid when you're stressed. This fluid is odorless until it combines with bacteria on your skin. Grace already explained about what is sweat and its causes. Now let's talk about what is body odor. Body odor is what you smell when you when your sweat comes in contact with the bacteria in your skin. Sweat itself doesn't smell. But when the bacteria on your skin mixes with the sweat, it causes odor. Body odor can smell sweet, sour, tangy, or like onions. The amount of your sweat doesn't necessarily impact your body odor. That's why a person can have an unpleasant body odor but not be sweaty. Conversely, a person can sweat excessively but not smell. This is because the body odor is a result of the type of bacteria on your skin and then how the bacteria interacts with the sweat, not the sweat itself. Your body odor can change due to hormones, the food you eat, infections, medications, or underlying conditions like diabetes. So, we have already explained what is sweat and body odor, and also their causes. Now, let us have our guest from Don Carlos School Technic College Criminology students. Salamat po. At paalala po sa inyo, hindi lang dapat makinis, dapat malinis. 